Welcome to Finger Family. I am Daddy Finger. Nowadays, Frozen Castle is the favorite theme for the little princess. Please check the YouTube description for the list of items required and more detailed steps along with the time. We are going to make a three tier cake. We need three round cakes, approximately 28 cm for the lower layer and two round cakes, approximately 20 cm diameter and 10 cm diameter for the middle and upper layers. Let's start with the lower layer of the cake. Cut off the top portion if your cake is uneven to make a smooth surface. Apply the icing on the top surface of the first cake and place the second cake on it. For details on how to apply icing, there is a separate video in the description below. Repeat the same step of smoothening the surface and apply the icing. Start applying icing on the sides. Smoothen the icing layer on top and also around the sides. Roll the fondant and cover the cake with the fondant layer. Remove the wrinkles in the fondant layer by pressing them from the top to the bottom gently. Be careful not to make any holes in the fondant. After removing all the wrinkles, cut out the excess fondant. Repeat the same process for the middle layer. For the top layer which is a clock tower I have used rice cake. You can use cake for this layer as well. Apply icing in between the rice cake to keep them intact. Stick up the rice cake flakes to your desired height. Cover the rice cake with fondant. For castle tower I have used biscuits of different sizes like Mari biscuit or Oreo biscuits and I have used the ice cream cone at the top. Roll the biscuits with the fondant layer. Keep the cone on the top. Cut out desired shape of the roof in a fondant and stick them on the cone using little water.
Repeat the same for all the towers. When you are staking the biscuits for the tall tower, it's better to wrap the biscuits in a fresh wrap to keep them intact. While mounting multiple tier cakes, the weight of the upper layers could smash the lower layer. So before you mount the middle layer, insert three straws in the lower tier which act as a pillar to support the middle layer. Then mount the top tiers. Now it's time to put some decorations on it. Cut out the main castle door, the castle window, the clock. The clock you could use the kids age as the time. For sticking all these fondants you may have to use some water. and some fondant in the shape of a snowflakes. And also add figures like Olaf, Elsa, Anna, whatever you see your wish. I made Olaf with a fondant. You can use ready made figures also for this. Plan the button location with edible marker. As a finishing touch, you can sprinkle edible glitter to get a sparkling look. Your dazzling frozen castle cake is ready for the party. Your little princess will be more excited.
subscribe to our YouTube channel by hitting the subscribe button below.